Hi, my name is Sherry Torres, and I'm here at Loops Knitting in Tulsa, Oklahoma, and I'd like to show you how to crochet a half granny square shawl. This particular shawlette is not quite as large as your shawl, because I like to use the smaller ones, but with this particular shawlette, I used the half granny square technique using self-striping yarn, and as you can see, it creates a very beautiful fabric. The second one I'd like to show you is also a half granny square shawlette that I crocheted using a novelty yarn that has many different textures. I wasn't sure what I wanted to do with this beautiful yarn, but the half granny square worked out perfectly for this particular project. To make the half granny square, you start as if you were going to make a regular granny square. Go ahead and make your slip knot. And I like to start with a chain three. I join my chain three to form a ring. And then chain three again to start the first cluster of double crochets for the half granny square. I'm going to make a total of three double crochets into the ring, counting my chain three as the first double crochet. I have my first cluster. I'm going to chain two and create a second cluster, also in the middle of the ring. Make three double crochets into the center of that same ring. And I now have the beginning of my half granny square shawl. I'm going to continue making these clusters of three double crochets with chain two between at the center, and this will grow into a nice large triangle. When I get to the end of my first group of clusters on this side, I'm going to chain three. That will be the first double crochet in my next set of clusters. I'm going to turn. I'm going to make my first set for this row in the top of the first stitch of the row. I have my first set of clusters. For this part, I'm going to chain one because this is the side of my triangle. At the tip of the triangle, I always chain two. On the sides of the triangle, I always chain one. At the tip of the triangle, I'm going to make my cluster of three. I chain two. Make another cluster of three in the same space. This is where my center increase is. Chain one, make three double crochet in the last stitch. To make the final cluster. At this point, I will chain three and turn. I will continue in this manner, increasing my triangle to the desired size. And that's how you make a crocheted half granny square shawl.